going to be taking a nice little walk down here along the railroad tracks and we'll see what I find because I like walking in little, little hidden spots uh, kind of like this one right so you got obviously behind me uh, some good snake plants some trees and you got this tall grass I come back here often to clean up litter but the objective of this mission is not to clean up litter it's to appreciate some nice uh, some local nature whatever you want to call it and if we see a train go by there's two trains there's the bright line which is a passenger train and then there's also these long trains you know freight trains and those ones go on for ages so we'll see uh you know we'll see what happens we'll see what we can find already seeing this nice field across the street here so uh, i'll keep you posted one thing i'm noticing here immediately is there's a ton of dragonflies around i don't know if you can see them buzzing around me um, but they are buzzing all over the place next to the storage facility it's a very cool bug i don't know how many types of them exist but uh, you see them a lot especially in this area i assume they like heat which is why this style this brand lives down here this is south florida for what it's worth so let me know in the comments if, if you know what kind of dragonfly typically buzzes around here i doubt you can see it on my iphone camera but let me know if you know train coming here shortly i'll show it to you in a moment first of all is this nice little cutoff here i come down this way a lot to clean up litter so this is a spot that i'm gonna have to tackle shortly you can see all sorts of weird plastics and tin foils on the ground and you can probably hear the thingy coming down i'll show you the bright line when it comes by here in just a moment yeah baby that's the bright line coming right down high speed rail baby That is the best train in the United States, in my humble opinion. Feels like an airplane. They serve you, you know, peanuts, coffee. You can order a drink if you'd like to. It really is pretty cool. The Brightline is an elite train and very fast and also actually the most deadly train in America. So if you're like me and you like walking along the railroad tracks, uh, please be cognizant not to get hit by that thing. This is the furthest down I've ever been along here. Look at this. I think this is a car bumper. Oh wow, and you see two tires there as well. So yeah, we got the bumper of a car right here. Interesting, it's actually pretty light. If you believe that, never picked one up before. I am no mechanic. And you have the tires that have been out here long enough such that there are plants growing in them. I think these things can be recycled for a decent value so if i'm ever trying to make a quick buck maybe i will slide down um to this spot and i'll scoop those tires and i'll see what i can get for them i don't know who buys them back but you can always recycle things there's always kind of creative ways to to do all that oh look at this too maybe i will clean this up a little glute glutosaural key pharma I don't even know what this is. It's not even really labeled as a drink. Maybe this is some... Oh, this is per, for prevention of diarrhea. That's what it says. Sneaky. I bet these bushes on the other side would be pretty good for stealth camping if you don't mind the train going directly by you uh, because that would get loud. It probably wouldn't be the best sleep on earth. I mean, these trains, they run late and they run early, but... Uh, nice coverage area and it looks like it's between some houses there uh, i'm always kind of on the lookout for cool little spots like that just in case baby you know the thing about spots like this if you live in an urban area like myself is it's not quite nature obviously but it is really nice. It's still refreshing to walk among the plants, among the tall grasses, see some uh, dragonflies buzzing around, whatever. Oh, look, someone caught on my stealth camping idea back there. I don't want to, you know, make anyone's day a little weird. And this might be a good spot to turn around at. But um, it, it's very nice getting out in nature, just kind of uh, enjoying a nice breeze, getting away from the passing cars and the noises of civilization. Uh, so that's what we like to do that's why i like getting out here spots like this usually i will be cleaning up litter while i'm out here 
which you can also see on this page if you're interested but um, this is just a nice nature walk this is more about staying in tune with mother earth baby let's ride